Right here. Great gauntlet play from oh, Sandstorm. Huge Great gauntlet play. Sandstorm Toby Storm is, is out. Is up there one from side. Blooming. Oh, one for another nice. one. Ground pound. They both beat each other once. Okay. So, outplayer just made they each got one. Winner, Boomy got one. And then Autumn, Boomy got one. So, 3 1 overall this year in terms of sets in the favor of Boomy. And they're on shipwreck, which means early kills will be abound. Oh, yeah. Any of these players could use a signature for a quick spike. But we're seeing Sandstorm start off with the gauntlet string, keeping Boomy on the corner. Throws out the down stick a little bit early. Boomy almost catches him with a ground pound. Boomy still able to touch the wall. Another ground pound. Wall touch will happen because that weapon toss from Boomy helping to cover him from Sandstorm. But now Sandstorm's got this scythe in hand. Could see a quick dash jump ground pound, but Boomy stays underneath it, able to dodge through. Dust coming out from Boomy, but it's going to be a point blank side signature from Sandstorm that's going to send Boomy off Up screen almost to death. death. And that signature will send Boomy off the top. Sandstorm has taken 35 to 40 damage about midway through Orange on his first stock. Boomy looking for the quick turnaround there with some unarmed offstage game. Lots of ground pounding. Definitely trying to stress this offstage against Sandstorm, which is such a scary thing to do. Sandstorm, with this Mordex, has two weapons that are very good at offstage, Ooh. and you're seeing it a little bit now. Boomy with nice the turnaround, turnaround, but Sandstorm able to get to that wall. Clash out. Works out in Sandstorm's favor. Boomy with so the turnaround. Gonna kill? Yes. yes, it does. Sandstorm still basically maintaining a similar lead from before. Maybe it shrank down just a little bit after Boomy got that kill. Down air from Sandstorm. Punish with the, the dunk. The down signature. Down air stops Boomy from getting the wall touch, but he still has the dodge. Getting hit gave him an extra jump back, and then his dodge was off of cooldown with that neutral signature. That lead has just grown to a full stock now. If I'm Boomy, I don't think I want to go back to this stage. No. Get rid of this stage. Maybe get some more platforms. It looked like he and LDZ were favoring uh, Enigma in their matchup, so maybe that's going to be the pick. But Sandstorm, again, clashes out with Boomy on the stage. He keeps shoving Boomy off the corner. And Boomy, of his own volition, going over the corner. Sandstorm with the punish from behind with the recovery. Still trying to keep him from getting that wall touch. Keeps him from the wall. That's it. And Boomy's done for. Sandstorm takes game one. I think Boomy was dead before that down air. He didn't have any more jumps or anything. Just in case. I think he was dead regardless. But Sandstorm made sure it was so. I know Boomy doesn't like Scythe. No. Like, he's, he's definitely tweeted out he's that had he's very not a strong fan of, opinions, uh, uh, of it's, it's like Scythe. Our, uh, Scythe plays the game for you. Just you get a lot of options with that Scythe. Boomy going to try to shut those options down. Going in with the unarmed for a little bit where he picks up his blasters. Nice damage nice. being put out. Nice! Oh, nice. good tears! Sandstorm gets up. He was looking for the spike with that dare rather than trying yeah. to pick up with a recovery because that wouldn't lead to the kill. He wanted the kill there. He's taking next to no damage. Just a little bit of a tap. Is the weapon toss come out from Sandstorm. Down, down light into recovery. Boomy with a massive lead. Definitely over regaining Sandstorm. his footing here on this map on Twilight Grove. Side light recovery from Sandstorm. Boomy responds with a down air. Sandstorm has to build up so much damage on Nabumi's first stock. Going in. Trying to get that clap, then there. But it's going to be a side air that punches Boomy away. Still needs more damage, though. Not getting the big strings that he wants. Yeah, he's finding next to no momentum right now. Boomy seems to be controlling the pace of the game. We're seeing Sandstorm camp that island just for a second before going back in. Picks up a nice two-hit ending in the recovery. That's not going to be the kill option that he needs next. Oh, good recovery. Not going to be the kill option. Jumps over the icicles. Sandstorm not finding the kill option. Can't set up for the neutral light into the neutral signature. If he can't get the neutral light, side light sends him off down air. Still needs to hit this. The recovery. And Boomy is done for. But all that just to get the first stock. Sandstorm's already stuck on his second in deep red. Oh, tried to go for the yeah, immediate cheeky. weapon pickup down sig. That definitely would have killed. That signature has more so much sig. force. That's what he's looking for. Even with a bounce off the main stage, I think that will kill. But you're looking at this big damage oh, from flash. Sandstorm. Oh, the Nairs and Sands off the wall. Weapon toss. weapon toss. Is he dead? Sandstorm yes, he is. seals the stock. 
over to the gauntlets. I'm surprised he's staying with the gauntlets. The scythe looks so clean for him. His recovery, recovery. Plucking him right out of the air. Something that Boomy has done for years now. Better than pretty much everybody in this game. Except maybe LDC. Even then, though, I would say that they're so close to that. That's what celebrates Good up airs. Great Blasters player from a near flawless Blasters player. Ooh, trying to get him off that wall. Weapon toss into the setup, the Neutralite into the Nair, turnaround. Sandstorm getting good damage with this Scythe. Great punish. Seemed like those Icicles were still there. I would have been scared of active frames, but Boomy knew the timing perfectly. His last stock red to red with Sandstorm. You see Sandstorm looking for those kill moves. Goes for the oh, he's unarmed! Miss. That is going the to kill! Does Sandstorm it. takes game two! Sandstorm, one game away from knocking Boomy into the lower bracket. Boomy, he tweeted six games left. It's going to be looking like close to nine at this point if he wants to win it out in the grand finals. Sandstorm in a very powerful, very strong position right now. Up two games against Boomy, who he's down overall against throughout this year in tournaments. Here's the crux, though. Sandstorm, if he gets stuck on gauntlets, I think Boomy has the advantage. The second Sandstorm gets the scythe, he was looking much better. But when he was stuck on gauntlets, he was not finding the momentum. He was not finding the dodge reads. So Boomy, maybe he, he plays it in a way where he can force Sandstorm to those gauntlets, might have an option. Now, even though... Boomy had more control in this game compared to the first one, or sorry, the last game, compared to the first one. Sandstorm still has no problem opting oh for this gosh, pass. Sarah's Huge Nairs. opening gambit. Over to the gauntlets. Down light side air, or side light from Sandstorm. Boomy did change his color. Sometimes that's all you need. You're right. What you said earlier about being stuck on the gauntlets does put him in definitely oh, a tough goals. spot. But he has that scythe now, and he still has the damage lead. There's a good nair from Sandstorm. Nair, not exactly a kill option for scythe. Back to the gauntlets, though. Might be looking for a dunk setup. Ooh. Likes to do the downlight down sig, but Boomy's above it. Oh, so many threats there. That weapon spawn coming in. Sandstorm's able to get it switched back to the scythe. Going in, recovery. Sends him through Man, the needle. A lot of damage on that stock. Just threading that one, and Sandstorm takes a big lead over Boomy. So other than that first initial time of being stuck on gauntlets, he has gauntlets now, but he has such a lead at this point. Boomy's looking for the big plays, trying to come in with the unarmed ground pound, get the spike, and yet again, only on gauntlets for 10 to 15 seconds before being able to get that scythe again. Now he is unarmed. This could be a big opening for Boomy. We haven't seen Boomy's bow yet against specifically Sandstorm. It's been mostly the gun show. Yeah, but his bow looked really good in his matchup against LDZ. Like we might be able to bust out some good stuff here, but yet to get any momentum. Really, we've only seen him go for the down signature with this bow. He hasn't taken very much damage, though. He has Sandstorm and basically kill oh. at this point. We're seeing some of the gauntlet damage come out. Sandstorm with the weapon toss. Nice down sick from Boomy. He's been really showing that he wants to hit that down sick. Puts it perfectly on that corner to spike Sandstorm. That'll even up the stocks. Sandstorm immediately able to snake that scythe. He gets it back so quickly, and you're already Ooh. immediately seeing the damage. Off the wall. Oh! Didn't hit the neutral light. He builds damage so well with his scythe. Side light, the weapon toss, he has the gauntlets now. But he's gonna stay on the main platform. Ooh, then quickly go for a jump ground pound. Another nair. Weapon toss from Boomy. Both of them throwing their weapons at each other. Now they're both unarmed, but Boomy's gonna be able to pick up the weapon spawn. Oh, neutral sick connects. Boomy the only one with a weapon at this point. One spawns in, and it's a scythe. Ground Ooh. pound. Sandstorm plays that ground pound really well to take out that stock. He is one stock away 
from sending Boomy into the lower bracket and guaranteeing his top two placement. This could be big. Just the neutral air, still not enough to kill at this point. There's the side light. What's, he's, what's he looking for for the follow up here? What is going to be his kill option? Recovery. Recovery. Kill. And it is Clean dead stock. even. Boomy on winner's bracket stock at this point. Boomy with the weapon control. Sandstorm sneaking out, getting that scythe again. The winner of this set, Boomy moves good on, guaranteeing themselves a top two placement in singles where they don't have to share that prize money with a greedy teammate. That's all yours if you win this set. Ooh, oh, just I thought you might have blast. ended up going into yeah. that, the bottom side of it. Boomy has the damage lead right here, but you know Sandstorm can negate that so quickly. Boomy being very careful about his positioning. Almost picking up the grounded recovery oh, like we saw disarmed. LBC do earlier. Boomy has the bow in his hands. I don't know if a recovery will kill right now. I don't think Boomy wants to risk a signature. Unless Maybe he is for sure that it'll hit. There's the end line almost sending Sandstorm off the screen. Sandstorm controlling the ground right recovery. now. There's Side that big recovery. damage coming out. Almost has Boomy a kill percent. Sandstorm 3 0 Boomy here at BCX would be the upset of the century. Oh, Neutral oh, Sig! Not quite enough just yet! Oh! Oh, Boomy takes it right out from under Sandstorm, Barely. keeping himself alive in this Barely. set! Barely! That was so close. I didn't think that was gonna kill. That, I, yeah. I, uh, that was a very close finishing blow. You saw Sandstorm was one hit away from killing Boomy. Had he got that down yeah, light on down that light, right yep. corner, that could have been death. That's exactly that it. Was scary. He would have done the active input to not pull Boomy the yeah, other direction. Him forward. Has a little bit more force, even without that extra little bit of force. When you're over on that edge of the island, you're, you're so close to the kill box. Was, that kill box is so close. Pressure is on on Sandstorm now. Because this is the first big momentum change. He has gone 3-0 so far. Just now he's 2-1. Was almost going to 3-0 Boomy. But will Boomy steal the momentum away? Will the pendulum completely swing to Boomy? Go to our next map, Twilight. Interesting pick. Lots of places where you can return back to the platform. Maybe that's what Boomy's looking for. He's going to have a lot less uh, risk off stage because he can go inside between the two uh, major platforms. Nice opening start for Boomy. Not quite as big as we've seen Sandstorm open up with before. Taking his opponent from white to orange in the first 15 to 20 seconds. Sandstorm struggling to find any huge opening at this moment. You see him retreating to the wall, trying to get a little bit of a breather, going right over the corner of that with the scythe recovery. Now he's over to the gauntlets. And there you see Boomy really utilizing this map to its full potential, going into the middle of the map so that he doesn't have to challenge Sandstorm on that right side wall. Downlight recovery, killing for Boomy. And this map was a Boomy pick. This was and I think yeah, being big. able to retreat to the middle, being able to give yourself room, is going to give him a little bit more of an edge than we saw before. Sandstorm, Ooh, chasing. Sandstorm chasing him. Boomy got the hit. Boomy got up. That might be what Sandstorm needs to do, though. Can't let him go underneath for free. I don't know how Boomy is punishing those side six. He's done that twice now. I swear oh, there's great still icicles dare. out there. His timing on that is so good. Weapon toss. Nice. Pick up dare from Boomy. Oh, One for another nice. one. Ground pound. The Sandstorm, Sandstorm is out. One stock left for Sandstorm. Oh, my God. What an immediate comeback from Boomy this game. That's so crazy because it was last stock red. Now all of a sudden Boomy is two stocks up. Downloading Sandstorm. This is kind of the same thing that happened to Lil Capped against LDZ, but just a little bit more quickly yeah. with LDZ as it only took one loss for LDZ to turn it around and find the edge. Sandstorm. He needs to finish this stock off of Boomy. Can't get the dare. Boomy! Are you freaking kidding me? Boomy just three stocks, Look Sandstorm. He is fired up. Look at Boomy right now. He is I've so never seen serious. Him look like that before. That is raw intensity. That's so intense right now. Boomy is ready for grand finals. Oh my gosh.
three stockings sent him away for either of these players. And we're going back to Twilight, where Boomy won previously. I guess Boomy won the last game. This was his pick. We're in a game five situation right here. Great gauntlet play from oh, Sandstorm. Huge opening Ground gambit. pound. Boomy's still living. The Nair. Boomy's still living. He's got the wall. Sandstorm backs up. Tries to cover this off platform. Side air bounces him off of it. Boomy still has jumps. Boomy Sandstorm basically saying, I shouldn't have oh! really get this far. Utilizing the hit stun from the weapon toss to confirm the neutral signature. Back and forth between these two players. Sandstorm picks up the scythe, picks up the damage. Boomy! A triple stare! Shoving in the sands, the oh! turn around! Sandstorm lets him get to the wall. D-Light goes for the recovery. Not going to kill. Gonna kill. He didn't even kill. block into red before that final blast happens. That's definitely not going to kill. Trying to pluck out of the air with that neutral signature. Trying to deny weapons. He picks up the scythe. Waiting patiently. Boomy not oh, going to kill. Not enough. It was smart for him to go for that option, though, over just the D-Light into the recovery. Again, a little bit oh, more force no, behind it. Oh, no, that's a punish. It. Icicles from Sandstorm. The side sig doing some damage. Goes for the recovery. Boomy nice with a turnaround there. I would be so worried about you using that side signature on the bow because you're oh, yeah. stuck in that for so long. There's going to be big punishes from Sandstorm. That's why I think we haven't seen any of the GC down signatures on blasters mm -hmm. like we used to see from him because that is a very easy to punish signature. It's got the two shots, but yeah, it locks you in place. Boomy still very damaged here behind Sandstorm in game five of winner's finals. And Sandstorm's gauntlets are stepping oh, yeah. it the heck up so quickly. He's been warming them up each game. Sandstorm on gauntlets is no longer a win oh, condition in. for Boomy. Boomy! Oh, Boomy! No! He didn't touch the wall! He got the recovery, but he did not reset himself back to the wall. In rare fashion, Boomy falls to his death there, running out of movement oh options. Oh goodness! That's something Boomy does to other people. Yeah. And now Sandstorm is the one doing it to him. Sandstorm going for the dash jump weapon toss. Boomy could take the stock off in just a little bit. Trying to keep Sandstorm back, but Sandstorm goes in. The weapon spawn is all the way to the right side. Sandstorm can't get past it. Oh. Barely avoids the flask. There's the spawn. Picks up the scythe and nice Boomy disarms dodge. himself. Yes. Great spot dodge around it. Trying to deny weapons. Has the gauntlets. Eats the recovery. Very patient. Neither of them wants to make a mistake here. The Nair not going to kill. Neutral height does it. You're seeing him juggle those weapons up and down, trying to delay the next weapon spawn for Sandstorm as long as he possibly can. While Sandstorm spawns back in, it's that Scythe. He has it again. He has Boomy in the orange. There's the strong down light. Nair turning Boomy around, trying Even to keep Boomy him on that left center side. Stage. Ground pound. Sandstorm this is trouble. back to the edge. This is scary. Boomy gets around. Oh, oh. going for the neutral Sig. Throws him over to the right side. Now ground oh, pound and it. Sandstorm sends Boomy to the lower bracket. Sandstorm <laughs> is going to go to the grand final.